Hello, welcome to another BNT unboxing video. Today, we're going to be talking about light guns. Specifically, PlayStation 1 light guns. Um, and I say plural, I do have more than one, but there's also more than one light gun type for the PlayStation 1. If you're like me, coming from an NES, there's just one light gun for Duck Hunt and a few other games. But Duck Hunt, we all played. One light gun, you plug it in, you shoot. You score. Uh, for the PlayStation 1, there were two types. The GunCon, that's in this box, that was made by Namco. And then, then the uh, Konami Justifier. Those were the two light guns available for the PlayStation 1. This is not it, this is generic. And everything else that followed that was either a GunCon compatible or a Justifier compatible uh, light gun. Um, so we'll go over the two different ones. Um, I'll, I'll use this one as an example for everything. Uh, and some of the games. The games I have that utilize light guns are Area 51, Time Crisis of course, and uh, Gunfighter The Legend of Jesse James. Now, I started off with just Area 51. Never got the light gun when I was in high school. Finally bought one. The the gun con, and the reason why I went with the gun con is if you open up the manual, you can see they have a picture of a gun, which happens to resemble to some degree the uh, gun con. Similar button layout, the gun con has a button on the side, uh, shaped very similar. The justifier looks very different than the gun con. Manual looks like a gun con. Manual, oddly enough, does not specify what gun you need it just says light gun so bought the just or bought the, the gun con gun con is not compatible with area 51 area 51 is only compatible with the justifier uh justifier they can be expensive they're like 80 to 100 dollars for any platform um i did find this one this uh this is submachine gun uh it's from naki n-a-k-i i found it off amazon brand new super cheap it was like 15 bucks um, this one will work with both Justifier games and GunCon games. Uh, it's used as a GunCon game. One of the buttons I think you have to push when the system boots up and then it puts in GunCon mode. Uh, so this will work with everything. The biggest difference between a Justifier gun and a GunCon gun is the GunCon or Namco developed this piece right here. This, is, uh, this plugs into your composite video input. And it's supposed to make the gun more accurate than your standard light gun. Um, all the other light guns, besides the, the gun con, just utilize plug into the control port. Flash on the screen, it reacts to, or it sends a flash to the screen, and that's how you shoot. Whereas the gun con actually intersects the video signal, and uh, the crosshair tracking is a little bit more uh, precise. So that's the biggest difference, but they're not compatible with each other. GunCon games will only work with GunCon controllers, and Justifier games will only work with Justifier game, uh, games. Um, it's very confusing until you get into the, the weeds. So if you get any light gun games, double check what, syst uh, what gun it will work for. Um, this one is for the Justifier, and these two are for the GunCon. Um, and that's pretty much it. It's just a... Uh, just a, uh, a roundup on uh, the different types of light guns for the PlayStation 1. Uh, these guns will work with the PlayStation 1 games on the PlayStation 2, uh, but that's, that's all they're good for. It's a lot of fun, though. Um, if you never played these light guns, a lot of fun. Um, do recommend you check them out. Do be careful which game you have so you can get the correct gun. I had to wait like a month to get a game that would work with the gun con to find out if the game controller was working or not. Uh, it was a mess, but there's some resources out there, but the manuals are not helpful. At least the one I have. Uh, another indication, and I only found this out after I got some gun con games, is gun con games will, will display a gun con icon. So that is one way to know the gun con games, the justifier games. They don't say. This one just says it's mouse compatible. So thank you for watching this short video on the different types of light guns for the PlayStation 1. 
Um, hope you enjoyed it. If you don't have one of these, one or either one of these light gun systems, do consider getting one. It's a lot of fun playing light gun games. Um, definitely a different experience than what you would have with a newer modern system. Uh, just one caveat, these light guns will only work on a CRT TV. Uh, it, it's the flashing. Um, I think LCDs are too fast or they're not fast enough. I, prefer, I think it's a timing thing. Anyhow, get out there, play some games, have fun, have a good night. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.